What's up y'all, it's Cozy. How are y'all doing on this fine day? I'm doing great, thanks for asking. Today we're checking out Nihilist. One man, deathcore band is what he says that he is. Uh, also the vocalist for Beyond Deviation. I've been following this guy on Instagram for a while. He's in the process of doing the 400 vocalist song, deathcore song, and I think it's going to be like 40 minutes long. I don't even know what to expect when that drops. I think it's at the end of May, but I'm just going to absolutely lose my mind. Before we get started, I want you to put your little cursor right over the subscribe button, and when you're headbanging to this song, BAM! Hit it with your head, hit it with your hair, hit it with your nose, hit it with your chin, and smash that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. Helps grow the channel. Thanks a lot. Now let's get into it. Suicidal by Nihilist. What? Oh my god, this dude's a creature. Okay. Disgusting. And I feel like I'm tripping balls. This has also got Casey from Angel Makers, so big fan. I am in some hellish landscape. What the fuck? This is nightmare fuel and it makes it even better. There he is. Oh, I like it when they layer their vocals over each other, that's dope.
He's hitting those whistle tones so perfect. He sounds like a fucking pterodactyl demon. Speechless. <laughs> Bruh, how long have I been here? Where am I? Did I just trip acid? My theory is that these two guys worked on this song when they were working together on that Beyond Deviation 400 song because it kind of just seemed like um, Casey from Angel Maker, you know, he just kind of dropped in. He was in the video a little bit. His part of the song was just, you know, kind of short. Overall, great song. An absolute mindfuck. It blew me away. I mean, I didn't know what to expect, but this... Definitely was not it. All right, let's break it down. I feel like this experience that we just went through can't even be quantified by my normal standards. I'm gonna give the song eight headbangs out of 10, uh, and that's because I feel like it was really just a display of vocals for the sake of vocals. You know, it's like how many different absolute dirty techniques can we shove into this one song, which I have no problem with, but because it was so heavily focused on that, that leaves room, you know, for, for more. Not saying anything bad about it, still 8 out of 10 is pretty good. For the music video, and this is what really blows me away, and I'm having a hard time wrapping my head around because this is different than pretty much every other music video I've ever reacted to on this channel. The only thing that is a little bit reminiscent uh, is probably Mars Attacks from Darko. Just because it's sort of that glitchy, like, real cutty back and forth, super trippy and that stuff. But, I mean, that's that's really where the line is drawn, and that's about it. Um, I mean, this was just otherworldly. Like, whoever edited this video, they just were like, Hey, man, you want some of this acid? Like, go drop it and go edit this video. Whatever you come up with is dope. And it was, I'm not gonna lie. So I guess because I feel this video is just an amalgamation of creepy, spooky, scary, weird, trippy stuff. I'll give the video a seven out of 10. So 7.5 headbangs out of 10, totally solid. I was hyped after this and I'm hyped to see what Nihilist comes out with next. I mean, I know his project with Beyond Deviation and this whole crazy world record 400 vocalist song is about to drop. I don't know if they can make a 40 minute music video, but uh, I'm definitely gonna see if I can incorporate that song into this channel because I am super pumped. Well, hit me up in the comments. what do you guys think about this? What do you think about Nihilus? What do you think about the crazy world record with Beyond Deviation. 
Make sure to like and subscribe if you like this video. I very much appreciate it. Thanks for joining me. I'm Cozy. Stay cozy, and we'll see you next time.